Well, this afternoon, Arizona's top doctor revealing new information on both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccine distribution. This is painting a clear pathway for the arrival of Yuma County's first allocation of doses. 13 on your sites, Cody Lee brings us the latest. Cody. Hey, Christian, good evening to you. The state will receive vaccine batches every week, according to Dr. Kara Christ. Yuma County's first batch of 4,800 vaccines expected to come by the week of December 20th. The FDA has approved the Pfizer shot. Now the first dose of the vaccine is on the way. This means more people will receive the initial dosing. 21 to 28 days later, the second round of doses will be distributed, ensuring that those people are fully vaccinated. The 384,000 doses that are coming are the first doses. So the federal government is sending us those doses and holding back the second dose. They will then, in three to four weeks, depending on which vaccine, they will send us the second dose, another 384,000. So how is the state coming up with how many to send to each county? I asked Dr. Chris today. They allocate it based on the specific priority population that's being addressed. So in this case, they looked at the healthcare worker population within each county. So it has to do with what the population of Yuma County is, and it's an ongoing allocation. So moving forward, we expect weekly allocations in order to, to be able to continue vaccinating more and more people each week. Maricopa and Pima County will be getting the vaccine as early as December 13th, receiving 59,000 Pfizer doses combined. And the state says the plan calls for a specific amount for those in long-term care facilities. Vaccination within our long-term care facilities will begin the week of December 27th. And Christian, over in Imperial County, the health department says they are set to receive 975 Pfizer doses next week and 1,000 Moderna vaccines by the end of the month. Reporting in Yuma, I'm Cody Lee, 13 on your side. All right, Cody, thank you for that.